just got back from the gym grabbing some leftovers from that uh, breakfast place yesterday and as you can see no one is here because everyone is already getting the hotel breakfast and that's a key step when you're booking a hotel and you have kids especially if you need to especially if you especially if you need to go off and train because then there's that empty like i try to come back before they wake up but sometimes they'll be up for 30 minutes or an hour and it would suck for them to just have to wait around for me so i like it when there's like a breakfast spot so they can get their morning started because for me i could either just skip breakfast or just pound a protein shake or whatever but i want them to be able to have some breakfast and have something to do while um i'm coming back and getting ready but this breakfast place is dope look at all the selection they have whoa who is this model i don't know there's supermodels in the breakfast spot. are you married <laughs> not right now <laughs> me neither uh, yoink. Yoink. Hey, that looks familiar. I bought that for my wife. Oh. I mean, I'm not married. Me neither. <laughs> so yeah, let's check it out. They got all these bread selections. Toaster. Ooh, baguette. el baguette. What'd you make? Oh, baguette. A little, a little cappuccino? No, you just saw the coffee right there. Oh, coffee. And then we got... Who do you think we're in? Freaking New York? We're in Oregon. Oh. Oh, we got this waffle maker. Look at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that right there. And then you got eggs, bacon. Look at that. Ooh, you know what I might do? I might add some eggs to my leftovers. And then Your you got son cereal bar. Wanted cornflakes. Yeah. He added brown sugar. Uh huh. And walnuts, and he is jamming. Nice Look at him. Ooh, tell me about your cereal. What you put in there? Some good stuff. What you put in there? Dark chocolate. Huh? Dark chocolate. Dark chocolate. <laughs> are you sure it's dark chocolate or you think it's brown sugar? Brown sugar, I mean. Ooh. Check this out. This is leftovers. Just want to make sure I finish. Got a big. You want, you want blueberry pancakes? <laughs> For some reason, this guy doesn't like blueberries. <laughs> are you serious? Greedy. No, I'm just kidding. I'm, just I'm kidding. not greedy. What did you just say? Because he saw my two OJs from Thursday. What is that? That's an alien sign. What do you? Why would you even say it if you thought that's what it was? That's not good, dude. Hey, but that's not in, in a public just, space. That's not good. There's two fingers up. You no. trying to do squats all morning? Is that what you trying to do? No. I think you no, know better. Playing. Cut it out. Anyways, add the old with the new. Some eggs with some of that corned beef hash. Looks delicious. And this guy has a milk mustache because he adds some extra goodies into his cereal. So the weather looks great today, Mama. Are we trying to go to Tamalich Pools? Finally. And then yep. Monkey Man's gonna jump in the ice water. Yay! No, no. And you know Good morning from Oregon. Look at what we gotta do. Just so people can see the frost is coated on our windshield. So he won't be able to see, but I'm sure if he were to drive for maybe like five minutes, it should just and face the sun, he should it should be fine. You don't think so? Are you talking to me? Yeah. What'd you say? If you just drive for like five minutes, the sun will like warm it up. I drove for five minutes this morning. But there was no sun. There was sun. I drove to the gas station, I drove to the gym, I drove yeah. back. It's been in the sun the All whole right. time. Alright. Whoa, do that again. And it hasn't worked. Again. Go slow. Like. <laughs> Pretty cool. <laughs> You're a cool guy. No, 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 we can't see it anymore. Face the sun a little bit. Like that, yeah. There it is. <laughs> I never trust this guy. <laughs> Can you see the happy face? Is yeah. <laughs> this guy's doing? There's an eye and then the <laughs> smile. <laughs> He's so proud of his work. Do you see the design? Yes. yes. <gasps> <laughs> Your face looks funnier. Can I see what my face looks like? Yeah. Test, 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 test. All right, guys, getting the show on the road. Attempt number two, trying to get to Tamalich Falls, or Tamalich Falls. It's in the Willamette National Forest. So far, so good. Nice and sunny in this part of town. Oh my goodness, it's kind of blown out. There we go. Nice and sunny in this part of town. 
but we will see as we start summiting the mountain because uh, that's when the elevation changes and it gets way colder and last time it went straight up from like a sunny evergreen forest to straight up winter wonderland and uh, I hope it's not the case and we can actually see it. It's not too far, it's about 36 miles. 41 meters. On our way there. All right, ignore the hair, but Taika had a really brilliant idea for the second time, uh, second day in a row. Taika, what did we just do? Snacks. Yep, do you want to show me the snacks that we got? No more, no more. Right, okay, okay. He wants to do the, show you how cold it is with his breath. You put it, you told me to put it in the orange. Oh, okay. And this is, what is this called? Your backpack is what? A big burger. The burger, yeah, it's a snack bag booger. though. Booger, a big booger. Yeah, but it's your official snack bag. Ooh, I, who's that for? Papa. Okay. I, I'm gonna say dad, because he doesn't know what Papa means. He doesn't know what Papa means? Oh, because that's insider's talk. Who got that? You got that when? I just thought. I wouldn't approve that. Okay, I well, know. it got in there. You got it last minute? Ooh, that's mama's. That's my mom's. We're gonna have no teeth left at the end of this trip. So much trip. Ooh, whose is that? Let me see. Show me the front. Ooh, it's Cheetos mine. Puffs. Mine. Look at that happy face. <laughs> A pop? You like that one? Yeah, I like those chocolate ones. We had it at school. Oh, okay. Oh, that's trash. Yeah, you could leave it on the side. You could leave it on the floor or something. For now. Oh, Pop Rocks! Is that everything? Yeah, like... We also got sandwiches. Yeah, but that's not fun. No, nah, that's not fun. But this time we're going to try to have a picnic out there. Because it is a little hike. And every time we're always trying to rush home and grab food and get this guy a nap. So we're gonna, we brought some sandwiches, some sahogis is what some people I call them. I should have got a lunchable. I don't think there was Lunchables there. They were. They totally there were. were. Yes, oh, right see. there. They um, were right by the sandwiches, bro. Yup, bro. Kid, kid eyes, man. They see Well, they everything. did it at the level, at the kid eye level. Oh. Uh, You're so tall, you know? You know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know that my mom is a tall boy. I think they know, baby. So we have finally reached the point where we couldn't make it last time because it was full of snow and we are driving this little CRV that we rented that doesn't have four-wheel drive. So happy to announce we're looking at new parts. It's pretty incredible that this whole thing was covered in snow, even the ground, you can't even see the blacktop. And just in a day like that, like this much is cleared. Yeah. And it's nice and sunny, so I'm so glad. Well, let's not jinx it before we get there. So, so Bowie, far, Bowie 12. so far, so good. This is the highest we've ever traveled. Take it easy. Look at that. Hey, we're getting copyright. You're hitting the notes way too perfectly. <laughs> Look at this. This is stunning. You are stunning. Oregon. That looks like a giant powdered donut up there. You are a very obese man on the inside. Look at this! What? This is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. Wow. This is what we missed the first time we were trying to come here. It's crazy like how much snow, but how? also how much trees too. How much trees and how much Look, snow. There's so many trees. Now you don't think the snow can hit the ground, but it can still hit the ground. I mean, the they're ground. pretty bare, Papa. <laughs> Look at that forest. It's just, there's but, nothing. But still. But still. All right, so we were driving on the highway, and then Mama saw this enchanted forest. So we found this little turnout. We're the only car here. And beyond this berm is the enchanted moss forest. You ready? Yeah. You don't want to go that way? I feel like it's there too. You want to go that way? Yeah. Okay, let's I follow do. you. I don't know why we're following a woman who barely knows directions, but let's see. That's true. I'm horrible with directions. Yeah. I don't even know why we're following, but... Hey, dude, you just kicked it at me. <laughs> He's doing his experiments. <laughs> Look at 
Yeah. Whoa. Look at all this moss. This is crazy. Okay, for once, a woman is correct. This is beautiful. But the sun hits on that side, which is why I want to go there. See how there's no sun here? It's not very enchanted when there's no sun. All right, fine. And once again, the man is correct. A point for the man. Ding, 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 ding. That's how you know how little you're correct that you have to keep telling. I'm correct so many times, I just don't care for tellies anymore. Care about that? Yep. Okay, as we summit this berm, we're walking in and you can see, well that was a road right there. But you see how much moss is all up in here? It's crazy though. Where? Everywhere, in front of your eyes. This does not look anything No, like go right there where there's light. Trust me. Trust me. My area looks better. Okay, well, we'll keep exploring until we find the best place. Oh, so then you agree. But I never agree. Never submit, young man. So we finally made it to the trailhead. This trailhead is a little bit hard to find because the trailhead isn't on the road. You kind of have to follow a couple of signs and the signs differ than what's on my map. On my map it says Tamalich Falls was like two miles that way. But then the physical signs, which I'm like, you know what? If it's physical and it's set by the people here, it's probably more accurate. So I was like, F the maps. I followed the signs into here and I questioned, I second guessed myself a couple times because I already came here. But we came back out and I talked to a local. I seemed like a local and he said, yeah, just come in here. So I came in here. So if you ever are looking for Tamalich Falls or the Blue Pool, uh, follow the physical signs, not the maps. But this is where, where it is. There's a little bathroom outhouse area and then the hike starts there. Go up there and hopefully we find a blue pool that is my goal for this entire trip okay really close okay we got your rocket pack on let's see let's turn around let's see let's see what we're working with turn around let me see Ooh, there we go where all the snackaruskis are all right the family is locked and loaded let the adventure begin uh oh, malfunctions already? Well, that's because this guy is not even on the trail. He's just straight up on the snow. I hope you know we have a hike and you're gonna waste all your energy here. Yeah. I would stay up. here. Let's go up. Okay, let's go. So, yes, finally, a promising sign. Literally, two and a quarter miles that way. So, we got two miles to go, okay, mister? Yeah, that's a long walk for you. That's why we pack lunch. <laughs> Which is also why you want to conserve energy if you even know what that means. Okay, Burger Boy. Burger Boy, we have two and a quarter and a quarter miles to go. No. The amount of life that is happening here is insane. Like, there's just random plants that don't even belong to the other species around it growing out of nowhere. And look out how much moss is covering that tree. Like those things look like straight up Cheetos. And then there's snow. And then there's running water. It's incredible. And they're just random plants growing out of nowhere. This is like a rainforest and a regular forest. And then like the Arctic had a freaking baby. It's insane. Wow. So cool. Go. Look, see that? Look, do not touch this bad boy. Don't touch that bad boy? Why? Because it's spiky? Yeah, we're, we don't know. Maybe you can shoot stuff. Oh, that's true. Let's run! Run! run. Let's get out of here! <laughs> this is so rad this is how like waterfalls form i mean obviously but seeing it happen like little by little in nature is crazy because you see like snow right then it's melting and it melts over there and it starts flowing and the stream gets bigger 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 all the way down here 
through this trail down here and it flows, flows, flows all the way to when it hits that big river. The level of nature here and the juxtaposition of this guy's backpack is hilarious. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at this crazy snow. And then you got this insane amount of moss. And then you have this water that's blue. And then there's more moss mounds over there. Covering these evergreen trees. Incredible. Every step of the way, it just looks insane. I'm like, what is this? Look. Like, what is this? I'm in like an enchanted forest or something. This is what books are written about. It's incredible. Wow. Okay, look at how high we are now. So we've been hiking for about just under three miles. And look at that. The waterfall does seem, or the water seems more and more loud. So I think we're pretty close to the waterfall now. Okay, take a look. We finally made it. Let's see. Do you see it? Or you want to pick up the snow? But look how blue that part is. It looks like someone just got blue food coloring and like just that dumped looks it in insane, the water. That insane, huh? That is so blue. Whoa. That is crazy. You see how blue that is? That is so blue. Wow. Finally, it's time for some lunch. Got these hoagies, Portland subs. Got some chips. <laughs> you okay, dude? This guy worked so hard. Look, 3. Point almost 5 miles took us almost 2 hours to get here. This guy worked hard. So this guy earned any ice cream, any root beer float, whatever you want, you you got it, okay? What about poop? Poop? Yep, I'll give you poop. Poop with frosting? Give me, give me 10 minutes. <laughs> That's all it takes? To generate it? Yeah. Yeah, we made it. But wow. Still incredible. I would love to find a way to get down somehow. I think I know the, the only way. Okay, monkey man, what are you trying to do? You're trying to stick your head in the water? Yeah. Do you need help? No. No? You're almost there. Here, I can help you. You can stick no, your head in and, no. and I'll protect your hand. I'll protect you from falling in. No. No? I'm trying to get like a snap out that I threw in. You want me to splash you? No, let me do it. Oh, you gonna do it? <laughs> okay. Do you wanna go lower? Hey, your hair got a little bit wet. Are you happy now? Yeah, I was just sweating. You were just sweating? Okay. This guy wants a picture on top of the log. Let's just see what happens. Don't follow dad, you stay here. Aww. Then I can get whatever I want. Yeah, but who's gonna rescue you if you fall? No. Here he goes. Right there, that's it? Okay. Yeah, but he's focused on what he wants to do first, and then after when he's done, you could do your thing and he could watch you. Oh my god. Look how cold it is. You can see his breath. That's how cold it is. You can see Papa's breath. I can't even zoom that far. Oh my god. Look at this. There? There? 
Okay, after the hike, we were so pooped that uh, we drove around for an hour because we needed to take it to sleep. And then we uh, actually got dinner at this really cool saloon. Shout out to Sister Saloon. I think it was in operation ever since early 1900s. So it feels like a true Western saloon. Um, but we made our way back to the hotel and now we got to pack because today is the last day of our trip and we need to head back to LA. And uh, thank you guys for enjoying our family vacation with us. It's always so fun recording these both as memories for ourselves and I'm happy to be able to share them with you. So now it's the chaos of where does everything go? Where does everything go? Where do we put in the burger backpack? Not like that at all. You've been just sitting on that chair on Instagram. What are you talking about? Exactly, and it sounds like chaos to me. Oh no, 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 That's no. That's chaos. You call it chaos? You got him, brother. <laughs> <laughs>